Well, hello, welcome to Izzy's Tarot. Thank you for coming to my channel. You could have been anywhere, but you came to my channel. So for that, I'm extremely grateful. Thank you so much. I am going to do a Scorpio Love Prediction reading for December 6th through December 12th. Please keep in mind, this is a general read. If it's not your story, it's not your story. Don't try to make it your story. Just take what you can from it and leave the rest. In addition, please know the energy can go either way. It can be your energy, your significant other's energy, or someone else in your love space. Keep that in mind as you watch and as you listen. If you enjoy my reading, please give me a subscription or a like. I will be most humbled, most honored, and I'm always very, very grateful if you decide to do that. Thank you in advance if you do. Please keep in mind with my readings, I do five card spread first, and I just give you a general overview of what's going on. The second part of the reading is what um, where the spirit guides tell me through because I clarify the cards, and you'll find out exactly what's going on. So if this is your read, sit back, relax, and listen to it to the end so that you can get the entire storyline. So let's see what's going on with my wonderful, intense, kind, sweet Scorpios. Show me, spirit guides, what's going on with my intense Scorpios. Show me, spirit guides, spirit guides, what. What's going on, my loving Scorpios? Let's see, Scorps, what you got going on. Five of Pentacles. Death card. That's you showing up in your reading. Strength card. Five of Cups. And the two of wands. Well, Scorp, I see with this, this is a reading about somebody that's just trying to get that darkness off of them. And when I say that, this is just, I feel my heart feels heavy with this reading. You start off the reading with the five of pentacles and it's either you, you feel a lack or someone is, feels like they're unworthy or there's a lack here. Um, they feel like they don't have enough um, for someone and they feel like they just, they just feel unworthy. They feel unworthy with this. Um, I don't know if it's whomever's in your love space or if it's you, but someone feels very unworthy here with this five of pentacles. It's very, very low card. It's a card of just feeling like you're just not good enough. But look, um, Scorpio, next to the five of pentacles, this is a very intense, I feel this in my heart too. This is a very intense reading because next to the uh, five of pentacles is the death card which is your card but death means transformation so it means you're really really trying to come out of this whomever this is if it's for you or your partner it doesn't matter whomever this is you're really trying to transform you're trying to come out of this feeling this deep dark feeling you want this darkness off of you um this is a deep dark feeling for someone that is definitely for someone because here in the middle of your read you have the strength card and I think someone may have left or may have walked because strength card means that you wanted someone to be on the same page as you. You wanted them to be on the same page but you just couldn't get them there and you love them. You really did love them intensely very you love them and the strength card is in the middle of your read which means that somebody didn't you just weren't on the same page you just couldn't get them to think like you think to um um to be there for you you were there for them but they weren't there for you and you are depressed about it because here again you have the five of cups here and the five of cups is, is very low it's down depressed and i'm sorry that this reading is like that we're going to clarify the cards and see what's going to happen but the five of cups is a very very um low uh card um there's always um there's three cups down there's always two cups that are still available to you so please don't stay in this darkness pull yourself up you are worthy I'm going to see here, but here what's interesting to me and what it looks very positive to me, and I'm going to continue to read to see what the spirit guys have to tell me, but that two of wands, two of wands means that you are now, you're looking up, looking into the future, you know what you want, um, and the two of wands just means that you're beginning to take actionable steps to uh, move out of the darkness, to get off of this, but you, you, you're very low, you're hurt, um, someone hurt you deeply. This is a very, very, like I said, intense emotional read. But let's see here. Let's see what the spirit guides have to tell you. Let's see what the spirit guides have to tell you. Um, 
Why is this five of pentacles? If this is your read, sit back, relax. Let's see what's going to see do what's going to happen moving forward. Why is the five of pentacles here for my Scorpios? Why is the five of pentacles spirit guys here for my Scorpios? Huh? You've got the two of pentacles. The two of pentacles. Now, the two of pentacles is a card of juggling emotions. You're juggling something, uh, something just left from this relationship, but you're juggling emotions. And and I think, like I said, the five of pentacles um, is here, but you're juggling your emotions because you're, you're, you're still down. You still feel like somewhat you're not worthy, but you're slowly but surely coming out of that because you have this death card next, which is your card, which is a Scorpio card, but it's transformation. You're going to make a transformation from someone, from someone. Because it's just that they they didn't see the same way that you did, but you did and love them intensely. So let's see why the death card is here. Show me, spirit guys. Why is the death card here? Why are you? Why is the death card here? Show me, spirit guys. Okay, you have the Knight of Pentacles. Yeah, it might take you a little bit of time to get out of this. It might take you just a little bit of time. A Knight of Pentacles is a a, a very very steady energy. Um, and that means that you are very, very steady. It might be very slow coming out of this energy, out of this dark. There's a feeling you're not worthy, but you're going to get there. You're moving toward that because the Knight of Pentacles is also about um, take you putting one foot in front of the other, taking the next step, moving to the next uh, phase. That is what you're doing right now with this transformation. That's what you're doing. You're moving to the next phase. So let's see why this strength card is here. And the next phase for you is to get up out of this, to, to let this darkness go. So let's see. Let's see. To let the feelings of unworthy, let your heart breathe again, know again, love again. So let's see why the strength card is here. Show me, spirit guys. Uh, the emperor. This could have been an Aries person as well. But the emperor card always talks of controlling. Controlling. Uh, mm, I'm going to say what I'm going to say. Please don't get upset with me. Um, Scorpio, I think that this was a control issue. I think that you tried to control a situation, but you can't. And if this was a, uh, if this possibly was an Aries person, you definitely can't control an Aries person, but you love this person and you wanted them to understand it wasn't so much for control for you. It was more about how you love them and you love them so intensely. And I don't think they figured that out. Um, I don't think they just, they just didn't figure it out. They didn't understand how much you truly, truly love them. So let's see. Let's see. Here we are again, though, with this darkness, with this five of cups. Show me why this five of cups is here, spirit guys. Show me why the five of cups is here. Nine of cups. Nine of cups. <sighs> Aries, you, um, the problem is, or I don't say it was really a problem, but you were content with this person you were content with this person you were happy with this person this person was not happy though with you and i think they just weren't happy because they felt like you had more of a controlling presence don't get upset with me but that's what i see with this reading because you wanted them to be on the same page with the strength card and here the emperor could be an aries person like i said but you wanted them to be on the same page so let's see why is this two of wands here show me why it's the two of wands is here Five of Cups, um, it, you're unhappy because you you felt like um, you just love this person. That's all. You just love them. And they didn't see things as you saw them. So let's see. Why is the Two of Wands here? It's almost like you're saying you, could, you couldn't even give me another chance. You couldn't even try with me. Because, you know, if it's an Aries person, they're very impulsive. They'll move in a minute. They'll hurt you. So let's see why the Two of Wands is here. Show me, Spirit Guides. Because this is what you want. The sun card. One of the best cards. Go Aries. Go. Um, excuse me. Not Aries. Go Scorpio. Go. This might have been an Aries person. No. Go Scorpio. Go. You want sun. You want fun. You want love. You want this back. You don't want this darkness. You want this darkness off of you. Let's look at this five of pentacles at the very beginning. It means that you are down and out. You feel like you're unworthy. Someone has made you feel that way. You're going in and out of this emotion though. Because you're trying to get this darkness off of you. Two of pentacles means you're juggling emotions. One minute, you know how when you're going through a breakup, one minute you're down, next minute you're happy. 
That's what's going on right now. But you're going to make the transformation because here you are with the Scorpio card right here transforming. And this Knight of Pentacles, very steady energy. But like I said, the Knight of Pentacles means that you're moving one foot in front of the other. Then you have the Strength card, which means that you wanted someone to be on the same page as you. But you got that Emperor there. It could be an Aries person, but also it could have been that you were more controlling that they, than they wanted. Because if, it's a, if it was an Aries, they are not controllable people and they move pretty quick. Five of Cups, you are, even though you are trying to get over this and you will get over this you were content that's what puts you back in this five of cups your heart hurts again that's what puts you back and then the sun two of wands you're taking actual steps to move to joy love that you had before you're going to win so let's see what my uh, queens have to say what do my, oh manifestation she says manifestation mojadi mojadi 